you have surely heard about a Latin American country with the appearance and size of a continent. Brazil, the land of soccer, samba, and easy smiles. Of soybean, beef, coffee, and orange exports. As of now, you will know a new Brazil. Geographical Indication Wine producers have bet on this continental country's geographical characteristics to express the identity of Brazilian wines in several manners. The wine-producing regions have made the practice of aggregating value to wine a continual process. This is a country that knows how to work its vineyards, that dominates the best techniques and produces a wine with its own character and personality. Located in the northeast of Rio Grande do Sul, the Gaucho mountain range stands out in the international winemaking market due to its renowned capacity to produce fine wines and quality sparkling wines. Benefited by adequate natural conditions, which allow for a wealth of fine and fresh aromas, local wineries have built a structure capable of producing high quality wines. Merlot grapes have an increasingly captivating taste in the Gaucho mountain range. One can also find Cabernet Sauvignon, Cabernet Franc, Tana, Ancelotta and Pinot Noir. White wines grapes include Italic Riesling, Chardonnay, Prosecco, Moscatos and Malvasias. Located in southern Brazil, on the border with Uruguay and Argentina, the Gaucho Pampa has been discovered as a fertile region located for the in production the northeast of fine of wine. Wines. So, the Long Gaucho mountain range has temperature variations between day and night due to its renowned renowned capacity to produce fine wines and quality sparkling wines. As in the benefited Pampa, by the southeastern Sierra has been investing heavily in modern and fresh cultivation wines. systems local for wine the production of fine wines, present in large properties. Wines. The region's vineyards bear grapes that produces wines of unmistakable aroma and color. In this new region for fine wine production, the red varieties are Cabernet Sauvignon, Merlot, Tanat, Turiga National, Tinta Roriz and Alfarocheiro, and the white Sauvignon Blanc and Chardonnay. In the heights of the cold Catarinense mountain range lies one of the most unique Brazilian vinification centers. The Catarinense Plateau is located on the border of the state of Rio Grande do Sul and Santa Catarina, in the highlands of the Sierra Geral. A state-of-the-art technological structure in the coldest region of Brazil produces fine wines due to its attractive characteristics. Great altitudes, low temperatures and thermal amplitude aggregate a well-balanced mix of sugar and acidity. In the Midwest of Santa Catarina, one finds the Peixe River Valley. Renowned for its grapes, the region produces attractive fine wines in the highlands. The region's stony soil favors the growth of red grapes, Cabernet Sauvignon, Merlot and Pinot Noir, and white grapes, Sauvignon Blanc and Chardonnay. The dream of producing high-quality wines in the semi-arid region of the Northeast has become a reality. State-of-the-art irrigation and handling technology and investment in the adaptation of varieties have transformed the San Francisco Valley into one of the country's most fertile regions, producing up to two and a half crops of grapes at any time of the year. In the San Francisco Valley, the most significant red varieties are Cabernet Sauvignon, Syrah and Ruby Cabernet, and the white Chenin Blanc and Moscato Canelli. Through these increasing exports, Brazilian wines have crossed borders and reached many different countries, such as the United States, England, Russia, Germany, France, the Czech Republic and Japan, among others. The Gaucho mountain range has an immense vocation for the elaboration of excellent sparkling wines. 
Finesse and freshness are results of the perfect balance between sugar and acidity. Aromas are delicate and non-intense, precisely what one expects from a great sparkling wine.